Hi, I'm Miles Budimer, Senior Editor with Design World. And I'm Lisa Itell with Design World. Today, Miles and I are going to look at an AMT31 Commutation Encoder from CUI Inc. Consider how capacitive technology works and where it outperforms optical. Used for years in digital calipers and as a proprietary method of measuring rotational movement, capacitive technology works by replacing a typical optical disc with a printed circuit board rotor containing a metal trace sinusoidal pattern that modulates an electrical field. The receiving end of the modulated signal then passes back to a transmitter where it's compared against the original through an ASIC. CUI's AMT encoder series uses such capacitive technology. Capacitive encoders offer advantages over common optical-based encoders. These include immunity to contaminants such as dirt, dust, and oil, reduced sensitivity to temperature and vibration, higher reliability, and lower power drop. Plus, they're easy to install and align and offer more flexibility thanks to a number of programmable features. Now for an overview of the specs. Featuring three-phase UVW commutation signals, the AMT31 series output can accommodate brushless DC motors with 2 to 20 poles, programmable via CUI's AMT Viewpoint graphical user interface. The series also offers supplementary A, B, and Z channels for servo positioning and startup sequences. 20 programmable quadrature resolutions are available with a range of 48 to 4096 PPR. Now let's explore the one-touch zero function for easy installation and alignment. Thanks to the digital nature of the encoder design, the AMT31 incorporates a one-touch zero feature to save significant time during motor installation. Traditional installations of commutation optical encoders onto brushless DC motors is tedious and time-consuming because the optical disc must be physically and precisely rotated to align with the correct motor windings. Once aligned, the assembly must then be checked via back EMF for accuracy. This can take upwards of 15 minutes per motor. In contrast, the AMT31 has an ASIC and MCU, so users can install the encoder in a few seconds. Now let's review how to install and align an AMT31 commutation encoder to a brushless DC motor. First, we mount a sleeve matching the motor output shaft diameter and adapter using simple tools from CUI. Then we mount the base for the encoder to the motor housing with screws. Next, we take the AMT31 encoder housing and snap it into place on the base. Then we take the tool, C, the centering tool, uh, once again, to set the height of the rotor inside the encoder. Next, we energize phase one and phase two of this brushless DC motor to lock the windings into place. We align the encoder using CUI's one-touch zero alignment module. Turn the module on, plug it into the encoder, and check the link to see that we have proper communication with the encoder. Then press the alignment button, and just that easy, we've aligned the encoder. So installing and aligning CUI's AMT31 commutation encoder series doesn't need to slow assembly. Thanks to its one-touch zero module and intelligent AMT viewpoint GUI, the AMT series allows for high visibility and control. Combined with high accuracy and simple assembly, the AMT31 works in a range of industrial, automation, robotics, and renewable energy applications. To learn more about CUI's AMT31 series, visit cui.com slash amt modular encoders or motioncontroltips.com. Thanks for watching.